Good morning. This tutorial will show you how to use your Android phone as a modem so you can connect your laptop to the internet when there's no other connection available, such as Wi Fi or DSL. Please note this tutorial does not require the use of any other software on your PC or Android device. What you will need is an Android phone running the latest operating system, the USB or sync cable that came with the Android device, and a PC running Windows 7 with a free USB slot. Okay, let's get started. Let's start off here in our network and sharing center. And you'll notice right away that we don't have a connection to the internet at all. In fact, it says you are currently not connected to any networks. So what we're going to do is establish one using our Droid device. First, you'll want to connect your Android to the PC using the USB cable that came with the device. If this is the first time connecting your Android to the PC, it may take 30 seconds or more for the PC to recognize the phone. Please be patient with this piece. So I'll just connect my phone now. Now let's grab our Android device and log in. From here, we'll want to go into the settings menu and from the settings menu we'll go into wireless and networks and from the wireless and networks menu we'll go into tethering and mobile hotspot on this screen notice the USB tethering option below this option it should read USB connected check to tether if yours does not read this, you can go into the notifications tray, select USB connection, and you'll see four different options. At this point, you should select USB mass storage if it's not already selected, and that should uh, change the status of your USB tethering. So if we go back to the tethering and mobile hotspot screen, all we have to do from here is select USB tethering. At this point you'll notice back on your PC that uh, the network and sharing center is attempting to identify now your network connection since you've selected that USB tethering on your phone. And after a while you'll see that these this exclamation point and this red X will go away identifying the fact that you are now connected to the internet. At this point it looks like our network connection has been established. You can see that the exclamation point and the red X is gone meaning that we have established a connection to the internet. So now let's give a couple of websites a try. First I'm going to try IP Chicken. www.ip And this page will show us a little bit of information about our network connection. It shows us our IP address and the host name that was assigned to that IP address. And the host name reflects actually the ISP that we're connecting through. And in this case, my phone uses Verizon Wireless. So I'm connected through the Verizon Wireless network. Let's just verify with one more site. could do that and then I can I'm on Google now and I can search for top news and I am connected to the internet at this time uh, so that's the end of the tutorial thank you very much and uh, hopefully you find this useful thanks